water money. I wonder what we're gonna buy. Hmm. Maybe we are gonna, I don't know, maybe we can buy a big old jugs for them. Maybe we can buy part of a well. Oh, I can't wait to see what we're gonna end up with. This is so exciting. <laughs> now, did you guys earn this money? Did you do something at home to help out? Or did mama give you the money? No. She let you have some? <laughs> I help mom. You help mom sometimes? That's really good. So thank you so much for your help. Yay. Oh, look, here comes. Yeah, bingo. There we go. Whoa. We like it. Oh boy, these are new friends you all haven't met yet. They're visiting Mr. Mark and Miss Pat. And you maybe will get to see them in Sunday school. That will be fun, huh? Yeah. Yes! <laughs> yes indeed! Oh, you're so mighty tough. There we go. We all take turns. That's good job. Nicely done. Thank you, guys. This is lovely. Actually, I shouldn't, you guys shouldn't all go sit down. You should just stay here because we got things to talk about. So if you were up here and left, you need to come back. <laughs> that would be good, Miss Pat. Hi. He's got lots. Andrew, you want to hold the piggy while he finishes? Sure. All right, now I'm going to talk to the rest of you guys while we're getting our water pig all filled up here. <sighs> I know the kids are bringing in so much money. It's very exciting. We are trying to um, buy something for water for a country where people don't um, have water coming out of their houses, out of the, into their sinks. That's right. Some people have to wash their wa wash their clothes in the river. They get their water to drink from the river. So we're trying to help somebody. Yes, you're doing great. Good job. Today, I want to talk to you about something really exciting. What happened last week? <coughs> Who remembers? What was last week? Easter. It was Easter. And what happened on Easter? The Easter, Easter Bunny brought us stuff. The Easter Bunny brought us stuff. And not only did he bring us stuff. And chocolate. And chocolate. Yeah. That's excellent, Mom. We like the chocolate. And he brought us a big egg and sour gummy worms. That didn't make you all sour now, did it? Okay. No. You know what else the Easter Bunny brought us? Easter eggs. <laughs> he did. He brought us Easter eggs, too. But out of all that, we also got Jesus back to life from dying on the cross last week. So that's pretty exciting. But... Some people just can't believe it. They think that's just too amazing. And it is very amazing. So this week, while all the disciples were following Jesus, the people who walked with Jesus and learned from Jesus, they all, after Jesus was put in the tomb, they all went to a house and they locked themselves in because they were afraid. And so they stayed there. And they stayed there for a whole six days. And on the seventh day, even though all the doors were locked, Jesus walked right on in. Didn't have to have a key or nothing. He just come right in. And he said to the disciples, peace be with you. And they were like, what? <laughs> they just couldn't believe it. And Jesus said it to them again, peace be with you. And they're like, holy quackers. Jesus is here with us right now. I can hardly believe it. <laughs> well, Jesus went away. And then one of their friends, Thomas, who wasn't there, because maybe he was at the grocery or something. I don't know where he was, but he wasn't there. And so when he got there, they all said, Thomas, guess what? He said, what? They, he, they said, oh, Jesus was just here. We saw him with our very own eyes. Thomas said, no way, get out of town. And they said, no, really, he wasn't. Thomas is like, Shh. If I didn't see it, I ain't believing it. No, I no didn't, that's right. I didn't see the dream house at Julie's. Did you have dream house at Julie's? Yeah. Oh, I couldn't believe that if I didn't see it myself. That's what the disciples said too. So Jesus heard him say that because Jesus is everywhere. Yeah, I bet he did say that too because it's pretty exciting. And so 
you know what? Another day, Jesus came back, walked right through that door again with it being locked, and he said, Thomas, he did give him chocolate, but I don't know if Jesus had chocolate that second time around for Thomas, because, you know, he was, he was in a mood. And so Thomas said, Jesus, I can't believe this is really you unless I put my finger inside of the nail hole. And I can't believe it unless I stick my hand where they pierced. And Jesus said, go for it, dude. It's right here. Right here. Do it. And Thomas did. And then Jesus said, it's right here. Do it. Put your hand right there so you believe. And he did. And Thomas said, oh, man. You are Jesus. I do believe. Oh, my stars. I believe. And Jesus said to Thomas, now, do you believe? Because you saw what, what, what you saw? You saw my hand? You saw my side? Is that why you believe? Yeah. And that's what Thomas said. Yeah. And Jesus said, you know what's even greater than your faith? Are those who have not seen me, but still believe in me. That's what's pretty cool. And that's who we are. We don't get to see Jesus with the hand, with the side. We get to see Jesus through things like when we come up for communion. We get to see Jesus when babies are born, when little cows are born, when flowers start budding out. We may not see the body of Jesus like Thomas and the disciples and Mary and, and the other Mary saw. But we get to see all the wonderful things that has happened because of Jesus. And we didn't have to see it because we just believed. Okay? So we don't always see everything, but we can believe in Jesus, though we haven't seen him. Okay? Mm -hmm. Chocolate bunnies and all. All right, now, Miss Connie yeah, is going to have eyeballs. Sunday school. Did he have eyeballs? No. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. I bet it was creepy. Yeah. Do y'all want to go to Sunday school? All right. Miss Connie is right back there with you. These beautiful boys and girls are going to show you where to go. And Miss Connie will bring you back up. Don't worry. Grandma and Grandpa aren't going anywhere. I won't let them. They'll be right here. Okay? If you get worried, you can always come back upstairs. Miss Connie says that's quite all right. Okay? All right. Let's hit it, guys. <laughs> 